Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Shadi Aqil. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received today a number of royal family members as well as the sons and grandsons of the late Sheikh Mohammed bin Mohammed bin Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa where they expressed thanks and appreciation to His Royal Highness for his kind sentiments and condolences on the demise of Sheikh Mohammed bin Hamad, wishing him abundant health and happiness. His Royal Highness affirmed that the kingdom, under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, has grown to be a single family and shares a common destiny that has overcome all obstacles thanks to the unity of its people. He noted the deep-rooted history of the kingdom, expressing thanks and appreciation for all national efforts aimed at maintaining and documenting its rich history. The Prime Minister stressed the importance of adhering to values and traditions that strengthen the cohesion of society and highlighted the strong fabric of the Bahraini society. His Royal Highness affirmed the importance of adhering to national unity and maintaining the gains of the kingdom, as well as its stability and security in light of the region's and the world's current challenges. The Prime Minister also highlighted the importance of promoting communication among society. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received today at Ghadaybiya Palace the United Kingdom Senior Defense Advisor for the Middle East, John Laurier. His Royal Highness expressed pleasure in the joint Bahraini-UK cooperation in various fields as it reflects their developing and solid relations. He also expressed aspiration to focus on development and growth, not on wars and disputes which wasted potentialities and depleted resources after the region became the focus of conflicts and tensions, expressing hope for the regional countries to cooperate and unite with allies to form a joint stance against all attempts. The historic cooperation ties between Bahrain and the UK and means of enhancing them were also reviewed. His Royal Highness affirmed the Kingdom's keenness on the continuous development of relations with the UK, 
highlighting the role of British expertise in Bahrain in the march of development and growth. His Royal Highness also highlighted the UK's efforts in achieving safety and stability in the region and discussed the regional and Arab developments with the British official. For his part, the United Kingdom Senior Defence Advisor for the Middle East expressed appreciation for the government's support led by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister to develop bilateral cooperation. Two people were killed and several others severely injured as the bus carrying Bahraini pilgrims suffered a painful accident in Saudi Arabia. The bus was heading to Medina where the front tire exploded, which caused it to roll over and resulted in the death of its driver and an 18-year-old Bahraini woman. Upon the directives of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, to distribute 5,000 housing units, and in line with the directives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, to meet the needs of the citizens, and in light of the government's efforts, led by His Royal Highness the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, the Ministry of Housing distributed more than 900 housing units of Khalifa City to beneficiaries. The ministry affirmed that the procedure for distributing the units was conducted smoothly amidst general approval of the beneficiaries. It affirmed its commitment to implementing the directives of His Royal Highness according to the approved timeline by regularly receiving beneficiary batches until the end of August. The ministry has reached the final phase in providing 25,000 units according to the government's work plan. For their part, the beneficiaries expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King his Royal Highness the Premier and His Royal Highness the Crown Prince for their continuous follow-up on housing services to provide adequate housing for the Bahraini family.